can be full of excuses unless you're Zion Clark. He prefers no excuses. The 20 year old college athlete has a lot to be grateful for. In fact, he does more with less. As Fox 8 sports anchor PJ Ziegler explains, Zion is an inspiration to his college teammates at Kent State University, not for what he has, but rather for what he does with what he has. Every It's Sunday worship at New Greater Peace Church in Canton. Music and faith are the cornerstone of 20-year-old Zion Clark. It is a really big part in what I do. God sent me through different trials to build, up, build me into the man that I am today. He comes to church with his mother, Kim. I baptized him in one of our services in the name of, of Jesus. He is one of our drummers at the church. He had a lot of ups and downs, but he's doing uh, he's doing really good, and his and his his life is being turned around. Zion has always been a fan of the drums. He would say, "Mom, I'm getting ready to practice," and he would go upstairs and he would be on those drums for hours and hours. When Zion isn't perfecting his love of music. He's attending class at Kent State University's Tuscarawas campus, building up his knowledge of business management. I definitely want to help run a sports team or something like that. That's not the only thing Zion is building up these days. Outside of the classroom, he's busy in the gym building up his muscles. His future relies on it. Well, I'll be a junior by 2020, and that's the 2020 Olympics, and hopefully I make it out of the trials and bring home some hardware. It won't be easy for Zion, nothing is. That's why he believes in his motto, a motto now tattooed across his back. It says no excuses. It's fitting. Zion was born with a condition called caudal regression syndrome. It caused me to be born without legs. My arms and my chest and everything have to be insanely in shape because if it wasn't, there'd be no way I could even, even if I wanted to, there'd be no way I could do some of the stuff I do. What he does is compete. Zion is a wrestler at the Kent State University Tuscarawas campus. My arms are my legs and my arms. So I have to figure out how to get in on their legs, still drive forward with one arm, or get the type of angle or leverage to where they can't stop what I'm doing. His head's low, get on the head. He wrestles in the 125 pound weight class, go, 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 go. but he barely tips the scales at 100 pounds. Yeah, it is a challenge, and quite frankly, it scares some of the guys. They don't care who you are, what you look like, what kind of disability you have. If you step out on the mat, you step out there as equals. Zion is 11 and 16 in his freshman season, heading into the final tournament of the year. He means a lot to the Golden Eagles wrestling team. It's just an inspiration for all of us. I mean, it's just a great guy to have on the team. If, if everybody's feeling down, we look at him. Brings us all up. Excuses are easy. Rewards are not. But with God, all things are possible for Zion. In New Philadelphia, PJ Ziegler, Fox 8 News. <laughs> he is wow. simply incredible. Zion finished second at regionals this past weekend and will head to nationals in Texas to represent Kent State. He is just incredible. I have goosebumps when I watched him wrestle. The thing wrestle. about pushing oh off in wow. your legs and Absolutely. having all that power, it's twice as hard to do what he does. He's just incredible.